Dropped a goddamn grenade, didn't he? <laughs> uh, just when you get a little overly confident. It is Thursday, April 14th, 2022. And as of right now, if you play Insurgency Sandstorm, you are still very much in the dark. Oh, you think darkness is your ally? Regarding new updates, new content, uh, you know, really anything happening with this game, there's just as been a lot of a standstill so to speak here with insurgency and despite the fact that this game is still pretty new on console very new on console less than a year old on console um lack of updates and lack of con of new content is, is obviously a, a an issue for a lot of players and understandably so there's still dlc issues for some people which is kind of crazy but ultimately we do love this game and that's why we keep coming back for it but might have a little bit of good news for you on the horizon and uh, you're gonna have to take that with a grain of salt um, because it's technically a leak and it was pulled down very quickly uh, after it come up but that might be a good thing so this artwork was leaked on a few social media sites including reddit or just over a week ago and then very promptly pulled down but something about you know when something like that gets pulled down almost immediately um, there's two reasons for it. I, A, obviously the person who did it just automatically feels like it was the wrong decision to lie completely about something, or there's some serious validity to it. And um, there are some other people that follow this game very closely that are feel pretty confident this is legit. Now, when it comes out or, you know, any kind of timetable for it, that is definitely an unknown. But, you know, one thing that you'll notice with that picture, which is great, um, is you've got some insurgents wearing some things that look very real i suppose you want to say that uh the attire they had the the head uh the 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 the, the head the headband that's not the right word i'm looking for uh the turban is more what i was looking for i'm i'm an idiot um but that that's good to see uh the cosmetics going the right direction however the bane in the room here is that bane is literally in the middle of all this um at the top presumably as some kind of an insurgent, I would guess. He doesn't look like he's going to be a security force character. Uh, <laughs> but I, I just, you know, that's an interesting choice. But we like this going forward in, in new content. Yeah, oh yeah, we'll definitely take that. Something else to note is that, you know, typically with um, new content for this game, it all usually almost always has come with um, at least two new weapons. That's been pretty standard. Two new weapons, a uh, new map, and uh, most of the time a new mode as well. So, you know... Uh, that would be something great. Obviously, a lot of people want more guns, more, I mean, just more content in general. We know this. Um, but just remember like, what is generally the norm for new content updates. Um, so we should be able to expect something similar to at least what we got with Warlord. And a lot of us are not terribly familiar with this game beyond Warlord as an update or from an update standpoint. So uh, let's... Let's see what we got here in the coming uh, weeks and month. Uh, we still need an official announcement, obviously, from NWI, which, you know, we'll, we'll just have to wait and see how quickly uh, or <laughs> poignantly that comes. So, listen, guys, I appreciate you stopping by the channel. Um, if you enjoyed the video, if you're enjoying the content, please drop a like, maybe subscribe, and uh, we will see you later.